Good afternoon, everybody. It's a late one it's for a Sunday. It's 430, yeah. We were, again, very productive today. Peter donated brought all the stuff that we bags. donated, all the stuff that's trash. Um, and we're headed went grocery to, shopping. Yeah, he went grocery shopping, edited. We actually haven't mentioned what starts tomorrow. Yeah. Give us a sec. Okay, one, we're parked, but we wanted to show you this receipt that we just received. So, so parking is free, it's included in your annual pass, so like they just scan my management, ask the last name, they say, cool. I scanned it, they asked my last name, they said, okay, cool, here. And they handed me this receipt. It was t dated today at this time, so it was just printed with some numbers and transaction numbers, but it says parking comp pass holder $0. What is this? Mm -hmm. They didn't tell I know, me maybe to do they're, anything Maybe with they're keeping it, track of it more. Maybe. Yeah. And two is that we have been getting our second bedroom cleared, obviously for um, Matt and Ben to move in. But tomorrow, my sister gets here, Jenna, and her fiance Bill. So we I call had it mentioned, Palooza. yeah, it's really a vacation. Fourteen Palooza. days. Fourteen days. Jenna and Bill get here tomorrow. They're staying with us for a week. Our cousins and their kids are getting here. Friday. Staying in Marriott Village, so we'll be able to give you a little tour of that. <laughs> yeah, they're staying at a resort off Disney property. They'll be here for a week. And Tuesday, the 24th, my mom, little sister Grant, and Violet, my little sister Christina, they get here and the we 24th. Go to Old QS. And we go to Old QS. For a week. Um, so Jenna and Bill, they'll actually be staying with us, and then they're going to come to the resort with us too when they get here. So it is a little bit of an overlap. We got, so, a, we got a DVC, but we don't have enough DVC to last us two weeks. No, not every year. So it's super exciting. So this is like our last day. Yeah. Um. So we. I think it's crazy. A little we bit. actually just posted that we're going to be in the parks a lot because people are on vacation. You know, they're gonna they want to be in the parks. They don't want to just. I mean, some of the time might be spent at the resort. But we're not but, going to Publix and Target and cleaning right. our closets while they're here. So, we'll there'll be an extra chance for you to see us out in the parks. Yeah, so say what's so, up, say hey. So be sure to say hi to us, like a little scavenger hunt on, of us on vacation for the next two weeks. Wow, wow, wow. I know it's an odd time, but this is the second time in a week and second time in my life where there's literally no line, no line for annual pass holders. Have we said what we're doing here? We're literally going to be here for like 45 minutes, but we had such a busy and straining and tiring My day. Band keeps falling off. I went on a run too. I went for I was shooting for five miles, and now listen to this craziness. Shot for five miles, got three miles in, had to stop, had to walk the two miles back home. The second I walk through the door, I see on Facebook um, our friend tag us on Twitter with a picture of the heat index of Florida of 104 degrees, saying, "Please be safe today in the parks." Time make the treadmill your friend. I know, I, if I can't wake up in the morning, or do it late, I need to do the treadmill. I just need to, for safety reasons. But we're literally here. This little old place. This little place, just to go to the lounge for 45 minutes to get, get some. Going to dinner at the bug. Yes. So what, are we grilling? No. We're roasting, like, she's no, making a roast. like a roast. are available. Coffee, number, uh, 38,492 begins. What are you going for today? I think I'm just going to do some kind of coffee. You know what I'm going to do? That sounds good. Do you know what I'm going to do? Um, yeah, yeah, classic. I threw my middle school diploma yesterday. Like, are you vlogging now? I threw a middle school diploma. So I said, but we need, I was like, I don't, I have a college degree <laughs> and a high school diploma. Okay, I need my, so my middle this school diploma. is like a perfect example. These stickers, we were just given to these. I would have kept these forever. I would have put I them in my sticker. I have an envelope of stickers. Not anymore. No more. So, 
instead of enjoying these stickers, we're gonna stick them on some. We're gonna back. give them to Lucy Pearl because yeah, or stick them on Lucy Pearl's back because we just don't need it. Peter says instead of being minimalists, we're gonna be Simple. simplest. Because like minimalists are kind of weird. Like you go into their house and they've got like one chair and a fold-up chair for when somebody comes over. They don't have a garbage can because they just walk it out to the dumpster. Like weird stuff like that. We're gonna go simple. I wouldn't say it's weird. I would say it's, it's extreme. extreme I feel. Yeah. So we're gonna go simple. Let's stay up. That half hour in the park yeah. might have been the most ridiculous thing we've ever done. But I'll be, I'll be honest, time. like, and anybody who goes to Disney knows that it was so worth it. Like, I feel yeah. so much, I was so, like, mentally stressed and physically stressed. And just to sit in that lounge for that 30, 40 minutes. Yeah. Have some coffee, have some pop. We like this place. We like this place just to look around at the construction, the families There's having fun. Coming a monorail. Very so yeah, it was just a really good trip and now we're off to go uh, to the buds. We have a snail that's in the cooler in the car. It's 140 degrees here and that's good to make sure it's okay before we leave because we might have to go to Publix to get a salad. Alrighty, let's check on this salad. Still cold. Pit stop. So good, bad thing. Sarah and I were running late because there was we just left Epcot late and there was traffic on I4. We had to do surgery on our camera. Had to do surgery on the camera, take off three or two blades since we were missing one. So not only half of it, the lens gets covered when it turns off. But positive to that is Joy Beth called us and was like, hey, can you pick up some eggs? I need some for what we're doing tonight. So we're gonna run in the Publix and grab some eggs. Oh, we guessed what aisle to go down. And look at the end of it. A million gajillion eggs of all colors, shapes, and sizes. I want pink eggs, or blue eggs, or yellow eggs. So, when I went shopping this morning, where I went, they didn't have shower curtain liners because I need a new one for my bathroom where Jenna and Bill were going to be. Oh, and we, they also didn't have candles we were at, and we need to get some candles. Oh, that's even more fresh. Yes. Put away the first, second, small one I. Are you saying two shorties or that one and that one? I thought that one and that one. Yeah, we're on the same page. Just, we're doing our assumptions wrong. Let's go. Please excuse us for the next foreseeable future. Probably the sun will be down when we're done. We're going swimming. interrupt this time lapse for you to see the food and how delicious it looks. Look at this spread. We got the pool. We got a nice table out. Look at this. Look at that. Ooh. Oh, that steam. It's beautiful. Butter. We got Sarah made a salad. Looks good. Still burned my hand on that fire just now. <laughs> Corn casserole. Yep. Love it. And this is my seat, so I'm going to take my a DVC lounge coffee that's nice and cold. I'm gonna put that right You're there. Listening. So as Joy Beth came out to make sure everything was there, she's like, I got this, 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 and I got Josh's weird sauces. This is Georgia peach and Vidalia onion hot sauce. I'm trying this. The thing about owning a home is uh, you gotta do your own stuff sometimes. That's the truth. You have to, if something breaks, you gotta fix it. And what broke today? Uh, Temporary. Today, temporarily, our uh, AC flooded. A little bit in the garage, just a little bit. A little bit. But he's gonna bake, you're baking us a cake? Yeah, Coca-Cola cake. 
What is a Coca-Cola cake? Coca-Cola. It's a cake with Coca-Cola in it. Does it taste like Coca-Cola? Uh, no, no, no. It's what? very, it's a um, very moist cake. Ooh, I love the good moist cake. So what goes great with moist cakes is coffee. Um, I brought because I, I feel like is it like my is it becoming my thing to bring coffee to these is, things? I love it. Like I'm totally cool with that. So I brought like Cafe Du Mont and some other kind of coffee, but today I brought a little mix of. Expedition Roasters because I just can't drink these fast enough and I feel like they're gonna go bad plus I'm not like the biggest fan of these two. I love the Main Street. And I love the Tiki Room. That's why there's like nothing left But I'm gonna let them finish it and maybe they'll keep one of these cuz I don't I'm I'm not a big chocolate coffee fan. So Josh has chosen to indulge in the enchanted Tiki coconut whilst Wilts? 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 I think? Wilts? W-I-L-S-T? Cooking the moist Coca-Cola cake. Here we go. I wouldn't call it a finished product because it's not like sitting, but Josh poured that chocolate Coke boiled mixture on top of it, and that's what makes it so sweet and moist. Mm -hmm. You have to put an emphasis on the oist. Oist. Yeah, it, uh, it kind of like seeped in around the edges more than normally would. Normally, like sets up on top, but hey, it's still gonna be. It's gonna be delicious, and I'm gonna love it. What are those chunks? Is that that's powdered sugar Ooh. that I didn't really mix up well enough? No, but that's it's a good little extra treat. You know, I love this one. something's happening on the TV. This is my friend, lady. She was sleeping just now until I woke her. Aww. This is my friend, Jess. She's hiding from the cam. Cause I'm too pretty. You're too pretty. You would actually turn everybody who's watching to stone. <laughs> this is what our night has resorted to, and I'm I'm a big fan of it. We just finished watching Grease. Um, I think she gets it from me. This is Jessica's con contribution. It's the best movie ever. I thought um, Grease was. Turn the camera off. Ooh, nice because head swivel, Josh. <laughs> there it is, and here it is. What do you all think of it? So what are we watching here on YouTube now? This is the best movie ever. Uh -oh. oh, I thought it was like... Oh, no. Oh, I know, but we have oh, the... Oh, no, I don't like to watch those. Who put that? Did you put that on there? The queue? <laughs> oh. oh. It's a new one? one. We're about to watch it. I'm not going to put it on the vlog because I don't want it on the internet. Top 10 Disney <laughs> character fails. So, I wish we could have a before and after photo, but uh, here's the after at least. Completely empty. This... We never showed you guys because it was always a wreck, but this is actually pretty tame. Especially um, since we had bins up to the ceiling on the shelves. We had these were sideways, so there was probably like 20 bins this way and more this way and all the way up there. Yeah. This is pretty reasonable because this is all empty, except for that. That's wedding stuff. There is like stuff we're going to sell and donate. It's very much organized, and we did a lot of work, a lot of hours this weekend, a lot of trips to... The donation, a lot of trips to the dumpster. I had a little interaction with four or five little root raccoon family and I heard an alligator. But it is 1.48 in the morning. Uh, we still have more stuff to do. Unfortunately, it's gonna fall out on this one right here because I gotta go to an office in the morning and I looked at my schedule to see if I could work from home, but I have a meeting at noon. The right. meeting that got rescheduled from Thursday. So this one's gonna work hard, but Sarah's sister Jenna and her fiance Bill will be here tomorrow afternoon or evening. It's good to good be home. home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.